important. When I lived in Texas, I became friends with a monk. He was about my age, and he was part of a, a new, beautiful monastic community. And he was a, a, a very gifted teacher. I was at some events where he was teaching, very impressed. Um, and he, I invited him to, to the Catholic Charismatic Center to do some teaching, and he's just phenomenal. Um, but he was sharing with me once in his community, um, they, they were based in a city in Texas, and the local people just love the, 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 the monks, the new young monks, and they would get all these invitations out to dinners and things like that. And the monks kind of felt, well, you know, you, you have to be, you know, social and show gratitude. I guess the people were also very generous to the monastery. And so they would go to a lot of these, these, these dinners and meals. <laughs> but the, the, the monk who I became friends with, um, he said he, he hardly ever went out on these outings. And he, was, he, he deeply loved the people, you know, in, in his area. And... And he would tell them, he'd say, listen, you need to understand my calling is to study. It's to prayer. Because he really was a contemplative soul. He loved to study. He, 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 he spent a ton of time in the chapel in prayer. And he told the families, he says, I, I do love you. But my way of loving you is to study God's word, to learn God's word, to, be, to get filled with God's word. So when I don't go to your, you know, dinners that you're inviting me to, it's not because I don't appreciate you. It's not because I don't love you. I do love you. But my way of loving you is to study God's Word. When I'm in reading holy books or in the chapel in prayer, it's because I love you. And, you know, each one of us, we need to discover how we were called to love. We, we need to have a vision for our own life. Like, how am I meant to love.